Hi! In this video we will see how to adjust the product project settings in Rhino Emboss and when we click on the icon the first step is to define the new project. So in here I can define all the settings of the project. First the type. In here I can define the result as a single mesh and in here I have the option to delete the base so it will keep only the outside curve of the project. The second option is to define a thickness where I can define also the delete base option and then define the thickness measure. In this case it's 0.5, of course I can type any other. And then we have the symmetry. This one will generate the same, exactly the same results in the bottom, symmetric from the top. Then we have the core. This allows us to create a flat bottom in our relief where we also can delete the base and of course define the cap distance. Remember these four types generates mesh result so all these four is a mesh object and then we have the surface. The surface will generate a nerve surface object. In here we can delete the base by default of course we can use the trim later to cut our surface and use any other tool from Rhino to cut and edit as we need. Finally the last one we can save as an image so this one allow us to create an 8 field image grayscale which will be the white color the biggest relief and the black the zero so this allow us to save an image and use to as a texture and this is very useful as well also the other possibilities we have is the size so in here we can change the the width the height of the project so in here we define the measures as you can see it will change this one so very easy we just need to define what we need and of course the resolution remember we can define lower resolution or high resolution of course the result will be heavier file if we use the maximum resolution also we can define the workbench position so it's in the center but I can define top left top right so as you can see in here it will change also bottom left and finally bottom right so in here we can define the position and finally the material in here we can define any material this will show different displays from our relief so in here we just need to choose any of this and it will define the material we use finally we can define the boundary box around the object if we activate this option and the assistance is the option to help the user to know the next step so this option if we are starting the software it's very important to help us to the step we must do in next so of course any moment after checking here and we when we are designing and defining our project as you can see now the assistant is, is telling us that ah, the new operation is the next step and now as you can see choose the curve it's the recommendation from the assistant so I can define any curve and in here I can define the curve so easily with the relief we, sh we check this option to refresh the results also remember any moment we can 
go back to project settings in this icon and change ok I want a mesh result I want delete base check here and refresh to check the results this is the idea we, we can define the project settings any moment and very easily I hope you like it thanks for watching